Hi guys, another video from Onyx. Um, this video is showing you how to change your icons, uh, your any of your Windows Vista icons. Uh, I think this this it works the same with, with XP. Uh, so I can change any of uh, the ones that pop up on here, say that or anything like that. So say if I open one of the documents uh, and the folder settings here, I can change into anything I like. So I'm just going to give you a quick video and I'll give you the links in the description um, for the video so you can easily get to them uh, if you go onto google.co.uk or .com depending on where you come from in the world um, and type in win customize .com and it should bring you up to this one it's the first link here if you go straight onto that and wait until it loads up Right, you go over to here onto the uh, the right hand side of it and go down to where it says icon package. It's something like the six or the seven one down. Uh, if you click on that, uh, th this is the bet at the moment. I can't find any better sites than Win Customize for them because there is loads and loads and loads of different icon packages that you can download. Right, first, you're going to need to download the icon packager. Uh, all this is is a program that changes all your icons for you so you don't have to manually do it which is right click properties change icon all that kind of stuff it, it does it for you but to download any of these icon packages you need to download the icon packager first so if you click on the icon packager website that will load up it will go into stardock because it's a stardock um, invention and if you go onto icon packager download and if you go to icon, pa icon packager downloads uh, there's nothing else down here, no. Because to buy it, uh, um, to buy it new, it is sixty nine dollars and ninety five cents. I think that's how it is in American terms. Uh, if you click on the download button on the on the right hand side at the top, because uh, it's an exe file, uh, run it. I went to my internet speed picks up a bit. If it does, while it's loading, I'll just tell you some of the some of the things you can do with it. What it'll do is if you've had any of the themes uh, downloaded before, of anything to do with Stardock, is it'll load the um, the previous uh, icon themes on there. Uh, some of them have got my wife, my, my internet seems slowing down for some reason. Um, um, and all you have to do is click it uh, and then click apply and just give it a few seconds and it'll actually change all of them. Uh, let me just pause the video uh, while this finishes, until this finishes. I am back again, uh, it's done now, so uh, it should pop up with a file like this. Uh, it says on name, I'll compact your publisher, Startup Corporation. If you click on run, uh, let me just shut this down so you can see it properly. Uh, it should say install Aware Wizard, verify on the contents of your setup package. Uh, this makes that case, anyways. Uh, once it installs, you click on next. Uh, click on accept uh, terms and license agreements. If you want to read that, then that's your choice. I never do because it's never anything that's, uh, new. Um, click on next again and next again, and it should install it. It's re relatively fast, so uh, you haven't got a problem about uh, doing other things while it's downloading. Okay, now it's installing. Uh, run icon packager now. Uh, if you want to run it straight away, then fair enough to see if it's working. Uh, on this screen here, do not do not click any full details. Buy now. Just click straight into continue, and this should open up a screen uh, of the icon packager. Now on the bottom here, it's got all the different ones that you've downloaded before. So I've got Alien Invader, and then it shows here what the uh, what it will turn into. If you just memorize that for a second, I'll show you what Vista normally looks like. Um, that's what Vista looks like, and that's what that looks like. So it changes them quite a lot, and I've downloaded that one before. Uh, so it'll just change it, and then all you have to do is, is click, um, is, is double click on that, or, or apply icon package, or, or whatever there. Um, what I'll do now is I'll close that down, and I'll show you on the same web website, uh, wincustomize.com, uh, if I go back to it. Right, uh, you've got all the different uh, icons loaded up here. 
Uh, you go to. Let me know. Let me just find a nice one. Um, I would like that one there. So say you want that one. You just go onto that. If it's got the little icon in the in the corner of the screen, if I just go back and show you. If it's got the little cut, the little icon in the corner of the screen, it show, it means that it has to have that icon packager uh, that I've just shown you how to download. You have to download it to get those icons. Uh, to get this, if I just move it down for you, uh, you've already got that, so you don't have to worry about that. And just go straight to download. You don't have to um, uh, you don't have to do any any subscribing or anything. You just click on the the folder there, uh, Morbury.ip. Make sure it's got an IP. If it doesn't have that, it won't download properly. It won't for, uh, load up uh, because that's the file that works on the system. Uh, it it will it will very quickly um, download. And then just click. In, you're on the same screen again. The icon packager. So continue. And there it is. It's popped up. And all you need to do is click apply, and that will change all of your. Um, all of your Windows Vista icons into that icon there. There is, there is literally. Let me just close this down. Um, continue. There is literally hundreds of pages of this. I think there's something like 398 pages. I think I can remember. Uh, but it's a ridiculous amount of um, of different icons in there, which which I make it the best website for changing your icons on. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's 98 pages. Sorry, there's something like. Uh, in other words, there's lots, and you can always go on to um, sort by last updated, uh, highly recommended stuff like that. So that's that sorted. Uh, I hope this has been of assistance to you. If you want to customize your Windows Vista laptop or desktop even more, uh, please subscribe. Any comments, uh, please post them. And thank you very much for watching.